Good evening, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to my TV. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button for brand new content. This your boy Gold Mouth Short. Let me get straight down to business. Today we're finna talk about the beef between Ice Cube and Matt Ten from West Side Connection. Man, the group had a super, super, super big song, man. You know what I'm saying? That was blowing up the charts and the album Bow Down went platinum. You know what I mean? They started working together in 1995. The group disbanded in 2005. Mac 10 quit, quit the group because, you know what I'm saying, there was some beef between uh, Ice Cube, brother-in-law, and, you know what I'm saying, Mac 10 crew. And, you know, a fight had broke out. And, you know, word is that Ice Cube uh, stepbrother got the shorthand of the stick, so Ice Cube just rolled with his stepbrother and, you know what I mean, kicked uh, Matt 10 out of the group because Matt 10 don't do no more business with uh, WC or Ice Cube. And Ice Cube went on to say, man, he was finna put the game in the group and make the game part of West Side Connection, you know what I'm saying? But that was back in 2008. You know what I mean? I guess uh, Cube decided to shelve everything, but he do feature on uh, uh, WC, Dub C stuff all the time. You know what I mean? And Mac 10, he wanted to come back and work with Ice Cube, but Ice Cube told him, man, I'm the GOAT. I'm one of your top five greatest MCs of all time. Nobody got a pin game like me. You know what I mean? I'm up the with Tupac, Biggie, and Scarface. My name gonna sit in there, in that fourth slot. You know what I mean? So whatever you talk about, I don't much want to hear it. You know what I mean? Niggas like Eminem and stuff get creative ideas from me. We all sit in the studio in the lab and we just chop up game and we work together. Dr. Dre ain't never called you in to do no work. Dr. Dre don't even really like your style of rapping. You know what I mean? Only time you hooked up with Dre was through Ice Cube. You know what I mean? You dropped the ball on the Snoop situation and let Master P sign him. So Ice Cube was really, really, really pissed off with this dude, Matt 10, because they had a group thing, but on the solo side, they was working with other artists, you know what I mean, between the album drops. And Cube was doing movies, and WC was keeping it uh, West Coast, but you had Matt 10 running around with No Limit. He was running around with Cash Money. He signed the Montana, Fontana Records. You know what I mean, he was just moving around. And he started hoop banging, and you know all them cats flopped over there. Salute all the boys that were signed. There were some good artists, but nobody couldn't really get a big hit. You know what I mean? If he had MCA, MCA, <clears throat> he pretty much was holding the whole label together. But MCA was too big of a star to be signed up under Mac Ten, and then he had got a girlfriend, and she broke him. You know what I mean? Because T-Boss had way more money than Mac 10. So, you know, Q was just sick of the man. You know what I'm saying? All that extra stuff he was bringing to the table. And, you know, it used to just be all them. And, you know, who banging and lynch mob. And then, you know, Mac 10 started bringing all these out-of-town people in. And they had to sign contracts and do all other type of work. And Cube didn't have time for that because he a boss like, man, I don't got to do no kind of business with these dudes, man. My pen game alone is better than everybody that you can go do a song with. You know what I mean? You got five billion for the label, uh, who banger. And man, the song that we did put out made way more than that. The whole label made. So I don't need you, man. The only way I'm going to Put you back down, Matt 10, if you kiss the pinky ring. 
So Matt Tim was like, man, I don't want to piss, piss. Matt Tim was like, man, I don't want to kiss your pinky ring, man, because that'll make me look soft, man. But Q was like, man, that's the only way, man, I'll put you down, bro, because I know you're going through some fun. I know you're going through some financial difficulties right now, man. You're trying to get back bubbling, man. But no, nah, man, you got to kiss the pinky ring because uh, Dub C, he doing good financially. He set. Matt 10, he not set. Cube is set. You know what I mean? Fat Joe, he don't mess with you no more. Birdman don't mess with you no more. T-Balls don't mess with you no more. What you going to do, man? You ain't been grinding in years. So... Q don't want nothing to do with him or West Coast Connections. Peace, I'm out.